Hello everyone, this is Juan, and welcome to my first Let's Play The Sims 3 video. To start off, just a quick shout out to everyone from the Daily Deal thread who inspired me to start doing these videos. I'm actually going to be using most of their sims in my video for this Let's Play series. You can see there's, there's 8 of them right there, but there's actually going to be 23 of them on the lot. And the lot itself is a custom apartment that I created just to house all of them. So I'm going to quickly go through and just introduce all the sims, show you what they look like and their various traits. I'm not actually going to show you the clothes for each of them because that would take way too long and I'm sure you'll see them all eventually. So we'll get to our first sim, which I believe is going to be Ryan Michaels. So, so. Alright, so this is Ryan Michaels right here. He is one of my sims. I actually have three of them on the lot. And just do a quick turn around so you can see what he looks like. So as I said, there's 23 sims, three of them are mine, the other 20 come from uh, users from the Daily Deal forum. And as for Ryan's traits, he's ambitious, artistic, frugal, natural cook, and a virtuoso. His lifetime wish is to be a master of the arts, so that's a master of painting and master of the guitar skill. His favorites include hamburgers, classical music, and his favorite color is green. And as for his astrological sign, he is a Leo. Sashto. Next up in the list is going to be Jason Conrad. This is the second sim that I have on the lot. And again, quick turnaround, see what he looks like. As for his personality, he is brave, disciplined, friendly, great kisser, and handy. His lifetime wish is to be a physical perfection by reaching the level 10 of martial arts and athletic skills. His favorite food is sushi, favorite music is indie, and favorite color is yellow, and he is also a Leo. Nushki Zanzi. Up next, we have Karina Lancaster, and this is the, a sim by Dicey10057. Quick turn around there. And it's personality. She is evil. <laughs> I have never played an evil sim before, so we'll see how this works out. Uh, flirty, genius, great kisser, and a schmoozer. Her lifetime wish is to be a gold digger and see ghost of wealthy spouse. I've never seen that one before either. I've never used that one, rather. I don't know. I was hoping to uh, do lifetime wishes of each of the Sims. I'm not sure. I would have to kill off someone. <laughs> so I don't know how well this is going to work, but we'll see. Uh, favorite food is ratatouille, favorite music is indie, and favorite color is also yellow, huh? And as for astrolo astrological signs, she is a Gemini. Alright, next up we have Adela Taurus, and this is a sim from Neptune's Ring 8. And she actually only has two traits. She's absent-minded and clumsy. And lifetime wish is to be a zombie master. Turn ten different sims into a zombie using the reanimation ritual or potent zombification elixir. Oh my goodness, you guys are going to make this difficult on me to complete all of these wishes. We'll see what happens. Uh, favorite food is vegetarian chili. Favorite music is indie. Favorite color is gray. Originally I thought that was white, but that's all right. I'm going to work with that. Uh, astrological sign is Cancer. And on to the next sim. Anavit! Casey Jackson is our next sim up on the lot. She's created by Aim for the Head. Quick turn around. Uh, start off, she's artistic, clumsy, hopeless romantic, party animal, and perfectionist. And a lifetime wish is professional author. That should be more manageable. Earn 4,000 simoleons per week in royalties. Favorite food is sushi. Favorite f music is rockabilly. And favorite color is lime. And astrological sign is another cancer. Pre Nufa. Here we have Lauren Ramsey, created by Lemon Paws. And I can see she's a bookworm. Recognize the other ones. Easily impressed, flirty, hopeless romantic, over emotional. The fairy tale finder. Adopt a unicorn. That's going to be an interesting one. I don't even know how you get a unicorn in the game. I remember if you ever come across one, so I guess I have to find one somewhere. That'll be interesting. Favorite food is key lime pie. Favorite music is pop, and favorite color is pink. And we have another Leo in the bunch. 
Snar Kushla. Morgan Anderson is the next seminar list by Meg1626. Another bookworm friendly. Is that no? Oh, good sense of humor. Another hopeless romantic and a loner. Oh, we have another professional author. So we're going to have two authors in the family. Favorite food is cheesesteak. Favorite music is country. And favorite color is blue, which is also my favorite color. And favorite, or no, astrological sign is Libra. Ah, boy. Next, we have Winged Paladin, which is fairy type. And she's created by Winged Paladin. Traits are adventurous, brave, genius, good, and lucky. Renaissance sim. Reached level 10 with three different skills. Oh, that's pretty cool. Might have to use the multi-tab 6000 for that. <laughs> uh, favorite food is pumpkin pie. Favorite music is classical. Favorite color is green. And she's an Aquarius. Nasloke. Nice, we have Tori Davis up next, uh, created by Elizabeth Bear. And I know she's an animal lover. Yep, and childish, couch potato, hot-headed, and socially awkward. And goal is to be super popular and be friends with 20 Sims. I don't remember if you can do that with family or if they all have to be strangers. We'll see how that goes though. Uh, favorite food is mushroom omelet. Favorite music is pop. Favorite color is turquoise. Astrological sign, we got another Libra. Deptagi. And this is Ivy Malone, created by Melissa M311554. Bookworm, cat person. I think that's clumsy. Am I finally learning these? Yes. Uh, hydrophobic and also shy. She wants to be a professional author as well. Favorite food is pancakes. Let's pop. Favorite color is blue. And we have a Scorpio in the group. Nayaka. This is Justin Flowers, created by A Pots. I don't expect everyone to remember all of the Sims on the, that I'm showing you right now, but I figured I'd at least give a quick introduction so that you'd know who they were for later. Start off, brave, charismatic, excitable, family-oriented, star quality, and lifetime wish is to be a superstar actor. So reach level 10 in the film career. Sounds pretty good. Haven't pursued that career path before. Favorite food, cheesesteak, electronica, and spice brown. And we have a Leo. Bazoof Nazca. Here we have Tina Gill, created by Tina G1947. And she is flirty. She has a good sense of humor, great kisser. Uh, oh, natural cook, star quality, and her lifetime wish is heartbreaker. We girlfriend of 10 different Sims. That one might be a little bit difficult to pull off. I'm not sure how much dating I'm going to do on the lot. I guess if it's dating, it's fine. Anyway, favorite food is cheesesteak. Favorite music is soul. It's kind of a funny coincidence because I put a cello in her room. And favorite color is purple. And we have another Leo. Oh, is that derpa? This next male sim is Alton Winford, created by Valgon57. He's rocking the uh, Adventure World gear. Is that the name of the expansion? Oh, World Adventures. Uh, he is adventurous, athletic, brave, charismatic, and genius, and he wants to be a great explorer and fully explore six tombs in each location. Uh, eventually we will be doing World Adventure and exploring a whole bunch of the other expansions, so I think that's definitely doable. Favorite food is tri-tip steak. Good choice. Favorite music is pop, and favorite color is turquoise. We have another Scorpio. This next sim, I'm probably going to pronounce the name and the username wrong. So sorry about this. <laughs> I should have asked. I asked for somebody else. Anyway, this is Anne Marie Boren. And the user who created it is uh, Anne Marie, I believe. A N M R E I J. 
And for personality, we've got someone else who's ambitious. Let's see, family oriented, flirty, friendly, and good. Oh, lifetime wishes to be a renowned, a world renowned surgeon. So I have to reach level 10 in the medical career. That's gonna be cool. Favorite food is spaghetti, pop, and spice berry. I don't even, well, I guess it's kind of like a plum color. And Scorpio is her astrological sign. Snar Kushla. Next up we have Pepper Zimpf, I believe is the name, also created by Zimpf. Should have checked on this one as well. Oh, actually Pepper Nymph, created by Zimpf. <laughs> X-I-M-P-H. And let's see, we have Artistic, Bookworm, I'm not sure what this one is. Oh, Excitable. Friendly and loves the outdoors, and her lifetime wish is also to be an illustrious author, so she wants to master writing and painting. Favorite food is spaghetti, pop, and favorite color is red. Oh, and we have our first tourist in the group. Weeb! This next sim is the third sim of mine on the lot. This is Devin Landale. And bonus points if you know uh, which other game had the Landale surname in it. It's a Sega game, if that helps. <laughs> he is an oh, not ambitious, artistic, bookworm, computer whiz, easily impressed, and a genius. And he also has the illustrious author, Lifetime Wish. Favorite food, hamburger, loves pop, and his favorite color is blue. And he is the first Aries in the group. Here we have the den mother of the group. This is Ellen Curry, created by Eden Curry, I believe. E D N C U. Oh, E D N C R R Y. She is artistic. She is family oriented. She's a natural cook. I don't know what this one is. Uh, nurturing and over emotional. And her lifetime wish is the culinary librarian. Learn every recipe. I don't know how difficult this one actually is to get. So. I'll have to start scouring the world for recipes. Favorite food is cheesesteak. Favorite movie mu music is Roots. And favorite color is Spice Brown. And astrological sign is our first Sagittarius. Babu. Here we have Jen Sim himself. This is created by Sim Jen. And let's see, she is an animal lover, a bookworm, I don't recognize this one, dramatic, she is friendly and loves to swim. And ooh, her lifetime wishes to be a deep sea diver, master the diving skill, and earn 40,000 simoleon from selling diving collectibles. I think this must be from Island Paradise. And favorite food is key lime pie, favorite music is rockabilly, favorite color is purple. And sign is uh, Aquarius. Oh, is that derpa? Next up, we have Adam Slade by Ajax Post. Some of you might know him for being the current holder of the DD thread on the forums. I think he did the previous one or two as well. Personality, he's artistic, he's a green thumb, he's handy, he's lucky and a natural cook, and his lifetime wishes to have the perfect garden, plant and grow eight different species of perfect plant. That one might be a little difficult because I've never gar done gardening before in this game. Waffles, his favorite food, favorite music is Latin, and favorite color is lime. And he is another Aries. Gazork! Here we have Jennifer Sims, created by Bouquet Catcher. I don't know what happened to the music. I just noticed it's kind of quiet. Uh, she is artistic, a bookworm, couch potato, natural cook, and perfectionist. And her lifetime wish is also to be a professional author. I know we've got a lot of bookworms and professional authors in this group. This is going to be a lot of competition to make the next bestseller. So, favorite food, pumpkin pie, classical, and another spice berry. And we have another Taurus. Nushki Zanzi. And this is Laura Holt, created by Glenn Catco. 
And let's see, she is adventurous, ambitious, athletic, handy, and perceptive. Oh, that's because her lifetime wishes to be a pervasive private eye. Solve 35 cases on the job in the investigator profession. I haven't done anything with ambitions pretty much, so this will be interesting to see how that works. Favorite food is cookies. Good choice there. Uh, favorite music is Latin. Favorite color is also Spiceberry. And another Libra. Swula. Here we have Jody Bishop, created by me1620. And she is absent minded, a couch potato, family oriented, good sense of humor, and a heavy sleeper, I believe. Yep, the first one I think in the group. Another Renaissance Sim, so I have to reach level 10 with three different skills. Favorite food is pancakes, favorite music is hip hop. I think that's the first one in the group as well. Favorite color is turquoise, and astrological sign is Aries. Suzel. And this is our last sim on the lot. This is Tessin Shiro, created by the user Tessin Shiro. Personality, I don't recognize that first one. Oh, genius, handy, natural cook, perfectionist, and virtuoso. We have another Renaissance sim. Oh my goodness, what three skills I'm gonna give to all these people. Uh, favorite food is tri-tip steak. Favorite music is indie. Favorite color is blue. And astrological sign is cancer. Okay, so now that the introductions are out of the way, and I'm sure you've memorized each and every one of them, I'm going to actually skip doing a tour of the whole apartment complex. Um, instead, I think we're just going to have everyone run around and mingle and see what goes on from there. So, let's see... Okay, I have autonomy, so hi, and away they go. So, I figured we'll start off and play with some of the objects on the lot while people are mingling with each other. Let's see, Ryan, I'll have him go get a gumball. So this is the uh, premium content gumball machine from the Sim store. It's kind of cool. <laughs> Everyone sounds so excited outside. Why is it I hope it doesn't kind of, like fall on him. I know that I think the soda machines can actually fall on the Sim and kill them. <laughs> Oh! Ah! oh. <laughs> Oops. Sorry, Ryan. <laughs> well, it's a good thing. Oh, really? That would happen. <laughs> um, is he handy? No. He just wants to learn the handiness skill. Who's handy here? Jason is. Oh, but he wants to go sliding on the beach thing. <laughs> oh, I can't believe this. Oh well. We'll have him uh, go in the pool later and try to fix that for now. Oops. Where is he? Oh, is he already in the pool? Oops. Oh, he was in the pool. Sorry about that, Jason. <laughs> oh, now he's going around like the longest way possible, too. Is he even going to. Oh, okay. Thought he was just going to go to the bar. <laughs> I know I would have. So let's see. Let's uh, see where Ryan went now that he's done breaking stuff. Oh, everyone's flocking. Okay, apparently I need to add another juice keg because everyone's flocking to that. And this is another reason I normally don't put laundry machines on lots, but uh, they just end up throwing their clothes all over the place. Actually, I think if I put down laundry baskets, they'll automatically go in there. I apparently forgot to do that. This was not my idea of interaction. <laughs> Let's see. These two are roommates, so let's have them get to know each other. 
Or Robert, just take off your clothes and do more swimming. I am Flem. Oh my goodness. How the hell? I really like those fairy wings and wing palette. I haven't actually played a fairy before. Actually, I haven't played with Supernatural at all. I know the one time I was playing, the zombies kind of drove me crazy because they kept scaring the heck out of me. Strongest sub tub. Bimbalop. Mazibo. Kuev. Az. Candlelobby. Nerf. Belko Webney. Okay, so this is actually Justin's apartment, and uh, apparently everyone's just gonna get naked in his apartment. That's just awesome. Chavi Lark! Whipnet Chavi Lark! In that case, it would learn something about Tina, but I guess not. So we're just gonna take a look, actually, see how they're. Hardik and. Oh, Oh, do I have? No. I was going to say, I thought I had headline effects turned off. I'm surprised I don't see a bar above his head. Silly Ryan breaking everything. Speaking of which, let's see. Where's he going? You're going to go swim by going into somebody's apartment? Where are you going? <laughs> I think all the pathing on this lot is just broken. CB Raba Naba. Right, apparently, I just have to make him go into the pool. Go and slide. Oh man. Wow, there's a lot of people in the pool. And nobody's on the wave station. Let's see, who can I get on the wave station? I don't know, is that Jennifer? Alright. Jennifer, go try the wave station. Go! Is there anyone not in the pool now? I know a couple of the sims I mentioned. No, at least one in the head hydrophobia, so. There she goes. This thing is really neat. I don't really know if it was worth $5, but. Oh. <laughs> I think that's cool the way. They come back up, but I also think that's kind of like cheating. Yes, I must say I'm amazed Whoa. that my game is running as well as this when there's like a million people in the pool and everything. Wow. I've got fountains going. Oh gosh, that shark slide looks scary. <laughs> Let's have, is that Do I have headline effects turned off? I must have headline effects turned off. I'm gonna fix that real quick. Oops. Nope, I did have that right. Off. Okay, now I can actually see who I've got selected. Okay, so she's over here. I don't. Oh, that was Jody. Oh no, I have Jody selected. Oh my goodness. Too many Sims that look the same. Uh. <laughs> So we're gonna have Adam go order some drinks. How does this thing work? Set up bar. <laughs> and just drop the drinks. That's cool. Oh. Quick drink. <laughs> Why is it when I tell someone to go somewhere, they go the opposite direction first? Oh, Adam has a tattoo on his back. That's interesting. Okay, he doesn't want to drink. Oh, no. Oh, make a quick drink. No, I just wanted you to have a quick drink. <gasps> <laughs> okay, that thing's silly then. <laughs> well, okay. Where did Jennifer go? Oh. 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 
Jennifer Sims is getting the hang is still getting the hang of it, but don't worry, she'll be surfing bigger waves in no time. Keep practicing. Who is the sim that had hydrophobia? Was it Was it Ivy? Oh yeah, she does, but she's still at the pool anyway. Is she gonna go in? Oh no. Oh yeah, she she is. She wants to play in the waterfall. This lot is just that good. Even Sims who are terrified of water wanting to play in it. <laughs> so this part here is actually a voiceover from the next day. I noticed when I was editing that I had some audio issues and at this point not much else was happening anyway. I think I was getting tired since there were long awkward pauses where I was just watching Sim swimming and not seeing anything. <laughs> so I'm going to end it here. Next time probably a tour of the lot and we'll go from there. I do have some little bloopers at the end of this where I kept fumbling over the intro trying to get right from my very first video and then the Sim kept talking over me and then I clicked the wrong one um, and I think I sounded a bit mad <laughs> during this but I wasn't so enjoy and I'll see you on the next video <laughs> bye hello everyone this is Wallen and welcome to my first let's play of the sims 3 video quick shout out to everyone from the daily deal thread on the official forums oh gosh hello everyone this is Wallen and welcome to my first let's play the sims 3 video Quick shout out to everyone on the Daily Deal thread of the Sims 3 forums who inspired me to start doing these videos. I'm actually using a whole bunch of their Sims in this Let's Play video. Oh jeez, why can't I just put sentences together? <sighs> Hello everyone, this is Wallen and welcome to my first Let's Play the Sims 3 video. Start off, just a quick shout out to everyone from the Daily Deal thread who inspired me to start using the... Doing... Oh my... Hello everyone and welcome to my first Let's Play The Sims 3... Oh, jeez. Casey Tell Jackson. Oop. Really? I hate this so much. <laughs> now I don't cool. expect... Who sim did I click? <laughs> <laughs>